Hey coach, welcome back to the channel. If you haven't yet, make sure you subscribe to stay up to date with all the latest content. At this point, we've pretty much got content going out every 24 to 48 hours. So don't stay stuck with your business. And if you want to reach out to even myself or you want to apply for our sports accelerator, then visit the description below this video. There's going to be a link hit the link, you can book a call with us to see if you are a good fit to work with us. Okay, so today I want to share with you guys another success story, another successful result from a coach in American football who we are currently working with in our program, right? So this is a post that we posted uh couple of days ago it was about five that five or six days ago um so it's a coach in in football who has just started up but he's looking now to run his first f clinic and he's already got 40 plus participants in that clinic so this is the the result that he posted in our community which says getting ready to head out this AM and set up for a clinic. I organized, had the opportunity to bring in a local football coach and strength coach out as a collaboration. Host City is also considering partnering regarding facility for this year at a percent of proceeds. Uh, 40 plus participants in for today and have their emails for later training dates that I may offer. Okay, so wanted to share this fantastic result from coach, uh, Coach Salvador who's part of the program, but also share with you three ways that if you are in football and you want to get your, your camps or clinics to the next level, these are very three simple ways that you can grow your camps and clinics using a very similar method to how Coach Salvador has started his first football clinic. So the first one is referrals. Okay, so something that we teach in our Sports Accelerator program is we help coaches to set up these clinics or camps one either once a month or once every two months so that it brings not just extra revenue into your business, but also you can set it up to, in a way where if you're working with 10 or 12 clients at the moment, you can offer a camp to them where they might get the camp for free or at a discounted percentage. And the incentive is that if they bring a friend who registers onto the camp, then they essentially get the camp for free or at a discount. Okay. So give you a very simple example. So this makes sense. If you're currently working with 10 one-on-one -on -one clients, and you want to run a, a specific type of skill clinic during the month, right? You could reach out to your clients and say, right, we're, we're looking to put together a group training clinic. It's going to be happening at this day, this time. If you guys refer a friend who, who registers onto the clinic, then you guys will be able to come to the clinic for free. So if you've got 10 one-on-one -on -one clients that you're working with, you get them into this clinic and each one of them brings a friend, then essentially that clinic then turns into 20 players. Okay, And then the extra 10 who, who registered and signed up, you get to keep their data and then follow up with them, which is something I'm going to share with you, follow up with them at a later date for any other training services that you may offer. Right. So that's number one, referrals. Now, the second one, and it's something that uh, Coach Salvador touches on, is he's going to bring in a local football coach and strength coach. Right. So the next one is bringing in special guests onto your clinic or camp. So if you are someone that's going to run a clinic that is specific to a certain skill in uh, football, so it might be you're running a clinic for quarterbacks, right? 
a, a great way to add more value to your clinics and to get, shall we say, more hype is potentially bringing in a quarterback from maybe a local high school. It might be a local college. And if you have really, really good connections, it might even be the NFL. Okay. So just bringing in someone that has a lot of experience playing in that position or that has a skill that you are selling your clinic. Okay. So again, use the, the quarterback, quarterback example. If you're looking to run a quarterback clinic, then a great way would be to potentially bring in a guest such as maybe a, a college quarterback who's currently playing at that level. Now, this brings a lot of value because if you're working with high school quarterbacks and you bring in a quarterback that's already at college, then they can provide your players with extremely valuable information for them. And also he can then share with them uh, the journey on how he made it to play at that level. Okay, that also gives parents a wow factor as well, because when, when parents come, they see that, oh, Coach Leo or Coach whoever has brought in a college player. It shows that not only your, your program is valuable, but also you as a coach, you're well connected within your local community, right? So the next one would be to add a guest. Okay, And again, if you bring in a really good guest, parents love it, kids love it, the chances are when you do your next clinic, they will want to come back and also they will want to bring a friend just because, you know, they're, they're, they're expecting you to bring a guest and that just adds a lot more value to players and parents, right? So that's, that's the second one. Now, the third one is something I touched on a little bit at the beginning and it's just having a follow-up process in place. So once you have set up a referral and each participant has referred a friend or brought a friend to your clinic, the next bit is now how can we figure out or how can we put together a process where we're following up with those parents to try to sell them on another service that we offer? OK, so if your current one on one clients, they all attend your clinic, they all bring a friend. You've now got 20 players at that, at that clinic. Ten of them aren't current clients at the moment or they aren't in your one on one or group training. Right. How can we now find a process where we can call Mrs. Jones, ask for feedback on how they enjoyed the clinic and talk to them about our one-on-one -on -one or our group training uh, program that we have, okay? Now, the beauty of the, this is that if they already did a clinic with you, okay, they know what your training is like, they know what your company is like, and they will, they will trust and like you a lot more whether if you were just randomly calling them on a cold call, for example. Okay. So the fact that they've already taken the time to invest money into your clinic, they've attended the clinic, they've loved the clinic, right? That just builds a lot more trust and a lot more like so that when you reach out to them for a follow up call on how they how they found the clinic, did they enjoy it? What's a few things that we can do to improve and also talk to them about your one on one or group training then the chances are they might want to do the one-on-one -on -one training or your weekly uh, group training because they've already experienced and they've all already invested into your company already okay so you need more help with this if you are a coach in american football okay reach out to us right description below you can apply for a call if you are someone that wants to take your business to the next level or if you're looking to start reach out to us. We speak to coaches every single day, either coaches who have clients, coaches who are looking to start. Okay, we have a program at the, at the moment that is adaptable for everyone in, in every position. Okay, So thank you for watching. If you haven't yet, make sure you subscribe and I'll see you on the next video.